need to speak to the science department. I found some weird objects in my backyard. Hello, this is Dr. Lachlan speaking from the University of New South Wales. Yes. Before I come over, I'm going to need some information on the object. Well, it's some sort of large box with some sort of code. Whenever I get near it, it says hello in different languages. Hello. Hello. That sounds very interesting. I'll come over right away. As you should. I think you will be amazed. Mm, that's very interesting. It's pretty amazing. Do you know where it comes from? I have a theory. I believe this specimen came from space and it is possibly a distress signal. Wait a minute. I know those two languages. That's Walsh and English. That spells we. Dr. Lachlan, Dr. Lachlan, there's something on the news. I think it's a, it's like another object. Hello there, is this of new? I need to report an object I have just discovered on the beach. It looks like a carbon circle with the leaves on it that just came from the sky. It could be dangerous and it might be too risky to try and touch it. Good morning, this is Oz News. Which beach did you find it on? And is it colourful? Report is Zoe. My location is Big Brains Beach. Please come. What if something bad happens to me? I don't know what to do with this. It might be part of some toxic waste. I will have to examine it to see what it says. But you have to hurry up. That's crazy. I found an object too. It looks like how you said yours looks like. But mine has no words. Tell me about yours. Is it the same? But I'm not at my science lab right now because I am only a practice scientist. Trying to be a real one, hopefully sometime soon. But I will have a proper look. Aha! It says pop a balloon to reveal a code. But what code? For what purpose? I tried everything I could do with it, like using it as a back scratcher. Oh. And using it as a mop, it just made my floor dirtier. I'm going to try popping the balloon. Hopefully I can trust what the kind of thing goes. I have been using this for me to squish anxiously while I am just waiting for you since you're taking forever. It looks like a steering wheel with the least to have different honk sounds. Oh wait, no, it's not. This is so confusing. What is this piece of junk? Oh perfect. You're here. Let's get to the bottom of this silly cone. Oh wow, I found something and it's the letters R E. Maybe try popping yours. We can maybe decode this and something good might happen. I found something too. It's the letter A. And it's a capital. I guess it's not useless. Do you know what it means? I think it's a bit of a code. I think I should call the police and I will tell you what they have discovered. Hopefully we can beat this together. Oh well look, I just discovered what the words can be. I think the code is R. Do you think other people have been experiencing this too? Maybe try calling someone you know. What? Well, sorry young scientists. Breaking news. There has been another discovery of an object. And it looks like it's fallen from space. I just got more information. And it was found in a yard. This is surely a crazy day. Okay, good luck to both of us. Hopefully the police can do something about this. I'll talk to the police now. They said they will call me if something happened with the mysterious object. But other than that, it was great talking to you. Bye! Well, I was just relaxing on my balcony when I saw this strange thing fall from the sky. It looked like some science, like a wormhole or something. It seems like there's another person who found a strange object in their backyard. Please tell us what happened. I tried doing a lot of things with it, like poking at it or shouting, but nothing seemed to work. Have you tried using anything that does not include touching? 
the object? Hmm, that isn't a bad idea. Maybe I'll use this torch I found. Try to find a code or a message or like something like that. Wow, the code says three. I think I found a similar object to yours. Ooh, what does your code say? Okay, I'm just gonna get my torch. Now for my code is Z I N G. I'm just gonna write my code down and your code so we don't forget or if we lose our object or if anyone may need it for science or anything. Hmm, since your code says zing, that makes the word freezing. I should send that to the local scientist. Is this the ISS? This is Oz News. Can I bring all the objects that have been found today? Thank you. These are the things I've been waiting for. Now I can finally crack the code and begin to work out what the extraterrestrial lab rooms are saying. This place needs codes into the box. Some should speak Neptunio. So I can look it up. Uh, um, hey. oh. We are freezing. Thank you. A mini TV? And a USB? Plug this in. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> 